Who do you put first? Obviously, the baby. The baby needs you much more than your partner does and much more than your family does. You, want, you don't want any time to think about that, do you? <laughs> <laughs> no, I spent probably about the first three weeks in my nightdress and <laughs> sitting on a cushion because I'd had stitches. And the last thing on my mind was a date night. I mean, I don't remember the last... Uh, it must have been, like, probably about six months before we had a date night. Yeah. I mean, he even had to move out the bedroom because I had the baby in the bed with me. <laughs> I've had all of my babies in the bed with me. Which Some of them till a bit older. <laughs> Some of them till they're 10 or 11. <laughs> he had to go in the spare room. <laughs> really? So you kicked him out? Yeah. OK. Yeah, I liked that time with the baby in the bed and everything, just us there and feeding. You didn't feel pressure at all to...? Not really, because I think Mark understood that you need that time, that bonding time with the baby and everything. Did you have a conversation about it or it was just...? No, just just the way it, was. it just sort of came natural that you just wanted what's best for the baby. Yeah. He packed his bags. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, came yeah. a sad farewell. Oh, beautiful. Oh, that's so lovely. That's so beautiful. That's Bobby Girl. Are you yeah. posing like a haddie there? <laughs> <laughs> I think that's I was so... like posing, I didn't even brush my hair. <laughs> <laughs> I just find that so interesting that organically and naturally that's what happened in in your house and 